Hi, my name is Brianna and welcome to the 16 week pregnancy update. Wow, time has flown and I feel like it's been a bit longer than 16 weeks. Honestly, I'm actually 16 weeks and five days today. So it is almost 17 weeks and the mystery will be solved a week from tomorrow as to whether or not I'm 16 or 17 weeks right now. There has been like some back and forth with my due date. I feel like I'm a little bit farther along just kind of by my size because um, I feel like all of a sudden I'm totally popping out. You'll see in the belly shot though, so stay tuned. This little girl is my second pregnancy if you're new to the channel. We hit 5,000 subscribers, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. It's amazing to know there's so much love and support out there. Welcome to you if you're one of the new subscribers and be on the lookout because there's gonna be a giveaway coming up soon. I'm gonna make sure I get some really awesome goodies for you guys. But let's dive into this 16 week pregnancy update because there's a lot to talk about and I don't have very much time because I've got to be on a work call shortly. I'm doing this on my little lunch break that I have. So how far along? I'm 16 weeks, five days, at least according to the due date that got changed, which means that's still four months, I think. But baby is the size of an avocado right now, so she's definitely growing. Total weight gain, I'm 132 pounds, which means I've gained 10 pounds since the start of my pregnancy. And I think why there wasn't any change from last week one, <laughs> apologies again, my house is a disaster, I'm a disaster, like I'm even like, I feel just in complete disarray, but we've been packing, 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 so I think all of the packing and moving around just, you know, was good exercise. Maternity clothes, I'm not wearing maternity clothes yet, even though I did wear a pair of maternity pants on Thanksgiving, but I was in my jeans the next day after that. Stretch marks, I'm using my Palmer's Cocoa Butter every time after I shower on my belly and other lady areas that are definitely growing as well, including my booty, but no stretch marks. How are you sleeping? Not enough, I actually had to be up at 3.30 a.m. for a flight this week when I had to travel and fell asleep in the Uber on the way from the airport to the destination. The Uber driver had to wake me up Sorry, but mama had to get her sleep. <laughs> best moment this week. We move tomorrow, so that will definitely be the best moment is moving into our new home. But we did, I don't know if you follow me on Snapchat. If you follow my Snapchat, you got a little sneak peek of what like the kitchen and the family room will look like because I Snapchatted when we had our walkthrough a couple of days ago. Missing anything. Still brie cheese, even though my mom found a pasteurized version for me. Thanks, mama. And I will be a little bit sad that I can't sip some champagne to celebrate the new house and my birthday is next week and a really big work deadline, so champagne would have been great. Movement, yes, I feel her at night. Mostly at night is when I feel her, but occasionally during the day too. But it is just the best feeling to lay there and feel a little like pings. <laughs> they really are, they're like little pings. They're not hard kicks at all at this point. It's nothing uncomfortable. Food cravings, I was dying for wonton soup. I had a Chinese food order last night. I got myself some wonton soup and some egg rolls, but it was really the wonton soup that I wanted more than anything. And oddly, there was some weeks where I wanted salads or crunchy vegetables, and that's totally grossing me out this week. Like all of a sudden I'm having a veggie aversion, which isn't a good thing. I'm still definitely probably forcing myself to eat some just because I know it's so much better for the baby. For some reason, that is not what I want right now. Breakfast sandwiches are still up there as being like in the morning I wake up just wanting like bacon, egg, cheese, breakfast sandwiches. As well as I've wanted guacamole, um, which is funny since baby's the size of an avocado this week. Anything making you queasy or sick. So the veggie aversion, which is really bizarre. And... <laughs> I went to a public restroom in the one airport and I don't know if they had not changed out the trash can or what it, it, it was just foul. It was a, such a foul smell. I thought I, I really thought that was going to be the first time I would throw up this pregnancy, but I, you know, peed as fast as I possibly could and got myself out of there. Gender, 
is a girl. You've probably heard me say she, and she still doesn't have a name. I know, I don't know why we can't make up our minds. Maybe once we're in the house and get a li little bit more settled, it will come to me. I've had a couple dreams with different names though, so we still haven't settled on one. Labor signs, no labor signs. Wedding rings on or off, they're still on. Happy or moody most of the time, I'm so happy. I just cannot wait to move, it's so exciting. I'm a little bit stressed, but really excited. Symptoms, my eyes are still super, super dry, and it's funny because an article did come up on one of the apps saying that both blurry vision and really dry eyes are very common during pregnancy, so. I think I'm just gonna have to deal with that, which, you know, this is what happens in pregnancy. And I've definitely, this week, I think you'll see in the belly shot, I've grown, so I've definitely had some tummy stretching out kind of pains. I've also started to have some leg cramps. Like every morning when I wake up, I need to stretch out my calf muscles and my legs. It just feels really tight and cramped up. Still really thirsty all the time, still running to the bathroom all of the time. That just comes with the territory. Okay, here is the 16 week belly shot and I'll show you first with my clothes on because I think you can actually kind of see, especially in the clothes, that there's a little bump going on there. And then here's the belly from the front. I feel like she's really protruding out here. And then from the side. on this side. So yeah, she's definitely a little round avocado in there. What are you looking forward to? The house? And I'm sorry if you've been watching the last couple of updates. It's just because I cannot wait to move into this new home with our family. And my birthday coming up next week. So two big things that are just really exciting. So there you have it. That is my 16 week pregnancy update. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comments if you are pregnant or you are trying to conceive. I would just love to know how you're doing, how's it going. I would definitely love to know if you know if you're having a boy or a girl or if you just found out you're pregnant, when's your due date gonna be? I definitely will add you to my prayer list and send some positivity your way. And I cannot wait to get started on some, I think I'm gonna do like a 12 days of Vlogmas videos coming up. Make sure you hit that red subscribe button so that you can see pregnancy updates as well as other Christmas and holiday videos as well as some new home videos. There will be a new house tour and as we start decorating, I'll do some before and after so you can kind of see what we're doing in the new house. I hope you guys have had a wonderful long weekend that you enjoyed Cyber Monday sales and that as we enter December, you really enjoy Christmas and this holiday season. I'll see you in my next update. Bye guys.